Well, just because the Montana Grizzlies were on a bye this weekend doesn't mean that Washington Grizzly Stadium wasn't being put to good use. On Saturday, we had a huge Class B football matchup between 2-0 Florence and 2-0 Townsend as two of the state's best went head-to-head. -head. Ethan Abbott recently made his commitment to Montana State, and the big man came to play early with the stop right here. But late in the first quarter, Townsend found a hole in Florence's defense. Trey Hovland connects with Gavin Vandenacre for a 17-yard touchdown. The PAT misses, and it's 6-0 Bulldogs. But Florence doesn't take long to respond. Pat Duchesne looks to his left and finds Blake Shoup, who barrels across the end zone. Eight yards for the score, and it's 7-6 Falcons. Then it's Florence striking again in the final seconds of the second half. Duchesne again rolls to his left. He finds Luke Mackey, who dives over the defender and the pylon, and he's across, and it's 14-6 Falcons at halftime. But disaster strikes for Florence in the third quarter. Duchesne fumbles the football and it's Klaus Rouser who scoops it up and takes it into the end zone and the Bulldogs tie it 14 to 14. On the first play of the fourth quarter though, it's Duchesne dropping back again and he finds Kaden Zalewski who takes the big hit but he's pushed into the end zone. The PAT misses and it's 20 to 14 Falcons. Now it's up to the Falcon defense to get the stop. Fourth down here for the Bulldogs and the Falcons force the incompletion to get the ball back. Then in the final seconds and on Townsend's final drive, they get the huge sack here to prevent the Bulldogs from going anywhere. And the Falcons take the 20 to 14 victory over Townsend at Washington Grizzly Stadium. We knew we had to come out with a lot of energy to play this team and uh, we just had to be on top of it. We couldn't make any mistakes and just had to come out because we know Townsend's a decent team, but we just had to go, come out and play our game. We always pick each other up and make sure every play we know what we're doing and if there's, there is a mistake we'll go to that guy say hey wipe it next play we got this and, uh, and then we'll come out next play and we'll execute. Uh, the D-line the D -line's job is just make sure the quarterback doesn't get the ball off and a couple of times we, we executed on that. I mean D-line was up front just being violent and physical and we let the backs do their thing. Well our coach has always told us about adversity and uh, he just told us better to let it let you down and we knew we still in the game and we just need to keep pounding hard no matter what score was we just had to play it all reporting in missoula kyle hansen mtn sports